An amazing trick works with Zorora Pokemon. For this, first of all you have to click on the Volt Switch button. And at the same time press the to base button. And as soon as you reach the base, without delay, you have to click on the Volt Switch button again, then you will be back there. Let's look at it one more time. Now consider this situation. Here some Pokemons are hidden in the bushes, I don't know how many they are. If I go to kill him. I may die too. So here I used this trick, when I was doing this trick Ninetales thought I was going to base. And he got out of the bushes, it was his biggest mistake, then at the same time I came here, and saw that there are 3 Pokemon here, so I killed 3 Pokemons, and took out Dredno easily. You can do the same on Zapdos as well. Cendrus Pokemon is one of the best Zapdos stealers because it lets you steal Zapdos from a distance. You don't even need to go near Zapdos, you just have to use Unite move at the right time when Zapdos are about to die. Then you can easily steal Zapdos, I have also stolen Zapdos from Cendrus many times in this way. If you're fighting with a Zorora Pokemon, always use the Volt Switch button, so that if you think you're about to die, you'll come back to the same spot by clicking on it again. There are some Pokemon hidden in the front. I don't know how many they are. I might die if I go there. So I go using the Volt Switch button. And as you can see there are 4 Pokemons. But it's a friendly match, so I told him to use their Unite move on me. Then as soon as everyone used their Unite move. I clicked the Volt Switch button again to come back to the same spot. And I saved. If you have scores, and you want to score them in the Gulpist. But there are some Pokemon that won't let you score. Then you can hide in these bushes that are around the Gulpist. And as soon as the enemy Pokemon get away from them, score it, it's the right way to score. Another amazing trick works with Blastoise Pokemon. For this you have to use Unite move first, and after that you use Eject button then you can take your Unite move wherever you want. Let me show you, here is Syndra's Pokemon. And I want to kill him with Unite move, so now I used Unite move, but as you can see it is out of range of my Unite move. So I used Eject button with Unite move, after that my Unite move did damage to the Syndra's Pokemon.
Always try to kill two or more Pokemon with your Unite move. Right now two Pokemon were chasing me, and my health was also low, so I waited for the right time and killed both of them at once. By the way, if I wanted, I could have used my Unite move earlier also, but at that time he could run away, and my Unite move would have been wasted. As you can see in this clip here Dradnu's HP is low and Talonflam fly at the same time. So I thought to steal Dradnu, when he comes down he won't be able to finish it, so in last hit I will steal it. But till then Syndras lowered him further, and now when Talonflam comes down, he will steal the Dradnu, so that's why I stole the Dradnu before he came down. You will have to take such quick decisions to steal anything. Before ever killing Zapdos, be sure to check the bushes around him, because most of the Pokemons hide there to steal Zapdos. I know this is a friendly match, but it happens most of the time, so always check the bushes before killing the Zapdos. To run Ganger's hacks continuously, first you have to hit the Sludge Bomb, after that you can run Ganger's hacks continuously. You all must know how important the team is in Pokemon Unite. If you have a good team, then most of the chances are that you can win the match, so if you want to find a good team then join our discard server. You will find its link in the description, if you play in Pokemon Unite VC in our server, then many guys will come with you in VC and you can make a team by playing with them. If you have any myth related to this game, then you tell in the comment box, because I am also going to make a Mythbusters video of this game.